Watching the stars and the city lights Right from the start said we never grow apart till we cheat out I'm having a moment. I am having a moment. So I'm at Yorkshire Arboretum. Now it's 50 minutes away from Leeds, heading towards Hull. And I've never been here before. I've camped quite close with Lynn some years ago. And I always thought I'd get back there and I happened across some link on some website somewhere and I thought, let's go. Weather looked fine, much better than it did yesterday. Some wonderful fluffy clouds in the sky, slight breeze. I have to say this is seriously stunning. It's not reached peak autumnal colour yet, but there are some Japanese maples. Here's an app called they'll blow away. What's it called? It's called Seek by iNaturalist. And I have to say, really is good at identifying plants. All you do is point your camera or point the app at it, take a picture and within a split second it comes up and tells you what it is. Now this is very much a scouting trip. That said, I've brought everything. The light is quite wonderful because there are plenty of clouds. You get lovely dappled light. Diffused light. You have to excuse me. Everywhere I look, there's potential. It is dangerous in that you can get that centenary overload where you see compositions, photographs, beauty, literally everywhere. Now I've only taken a couple of photographs. There's a bird in the in the lake, a, a, a cast iron or a metal bird, swooping down into the lake, which I've taken a few long exposures of, as you do. If I was to say the word problem, and there is a slight problem. Although it's 120 acres, according to a little map you get when you come in. And it is, or it does appear to be quite spread out. The problem I'm having, as you do with woodland photography, is trying to get separation or trying to isolate um, a photograph or isolate something that you've seen in the scene. As I said, up just up that way, above the lake, there are some absolutely brilliantly bright red Japanese maples. But trying to get an angle to isolate them, extremely difficult. I took a, an iPhone photograph, which I'll, I'll post up, but if this specific tree was isolated on a, against a green background, a green background with some mist, Splendid. Now I did try to get in closer to try to exclude anything um, and that could work with the with the tree trunk being quite static and multi colours and the red surrounding it. But again I couldn't I went high, I went low, I went left, and right, I went closer, I went further and further back. I just couldn't isolate the um, the tree to get a pleasing composition. One guy down there as well. Oh, yeah. Where I am now is just near the end. There's a slight detour that takes you away from the path, and it looks like this is a place where they do children's activities because you have piles of trees everywhere. Um, 
do not climb signs everywhere and there's a sign there that says for school children. A little fire there as well, which I suspect is a campsite fire for school children's events. Anyway, I feel I'm, I'm rambling. It's half past one now, so I'm going to head to the cafe. I've been talking to a couple from Hull who said the burgers are awesome, so I'll be having a burger for my Sunday lunch and a cup of coffee and a, a fruit juice. Yep, all this area is fenced off. There are no silver birches. Second complaint. I can't complain while I'm here. All I can hear is the wind. Hippie! Yeah, as the, as the sun comes through the canopy, it backlights some of the leaves wonderfully. The, the possibilities really are endless. You've got the side line hitting the trees, some lovely textured photographs. You've got the sky with the wonderful fluffy clouds. As I said, I am having a moment. These are the days that are absolutely glorious and well worth paying seven pounds to get in. Wow, that wind. You can't not be passionate about these places. It smells wonderful. You can almost taste nature. I shall stop there before I, I melt. Anyway, here's what I've got. No portfolio photographs, but as an experience today has been wonderful. Anyway, Photograph, food, find my car, and any other Fs I can think of. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyway, see ya. This town is on its knees, you know guidance overseas, I'm telling ya. Oh, it's more to this than what you see. You know this town's got the best of me. Sure it's a